Hey guys welcome to our channel today we are going to see about micro small and medium enterprises that is msme sector this article from page number 15 of the hindu paper reads cabinet committee okays 50000 crore infusion for msmes this news is a continuation of last month information in which government has introduced economic stimulus package to revive the msme sector which is adversely affected due to the covid-19 pandemic so on the account of it cabinet committee on economic affairs gave approval to the various measures announced by the finance minister these are the measures undertaken by the government to revive the msme sector here i have given the highlights of five measures undertaken by the government what are those measures first one new definitions of msme second thing collateral free automatic loan for msmes third one rupees 50000 crore equity infusion for msmes through funds of fund fourth one rupees 20000 crore subordinate debt for stressed msmes fifth one global tenders to be disallowed up to 200 crores now we will see in detail about each initiatives definition of msmes definition of msmes is provided under micro small and medium enterprises development act 2006 here i have posted the definition of existing and revised msmes directly sourced from government you may have the question what is the need to change the definition is there any concern in existing definition of msmes yes guys there are few problems here if you see in existing definition MSMEs are classified in terms of investment in plants and machineries and if you see investment level is too low here is the problem in order to avoid losing the status of MSME industries deliberately keep their investments below the limits therefore in order to push the MSMEs to the bigger level of progress the change seems necessary and it's also long term demand to change the definition of MSME which become finally fruitful with the government announcement what are the important changes made in new definition investment limits will be revised upwards and also there is additional criteria of turnover is also introduced and distinction between manufacturing and service sector definition to be eliminated in the new one next initiative MSMEs face severe shortage of equity so government recommended to set up funds of fund with corpus of 10000 crores here you may have a doubt about funds of fund and it's also important from the examination perspective UK singa committee on MSME had recommended for setting up of funds of fund earth rupees 10000 crore for MSME sector the committee mentioned that these funds of fund should invest in venture capital firms which provide equity support to msmes and these funds should be managed by the small industries development bank of india this recommendation of the committee is being implemented by the government what is funds of fund this type of fund is already existing in startups it is a fund that makes indirect investments in various sectors this fund is considered as fathers fund why is it so because money from this fund will be invested in various other alternate investment fund and also in venture capital which provide equity support to the msmes next provision is about subordinate debt the government has introduced a scheme of subordinate debt for stressed msmes and it also provide a support of 4000 crores to the credit guarantee fund trust for micro small and enterprises what is cgt mse it's a fund to provide credit guarantee to the banks that is if the bank incurred any loss on providing subordinate debt it will be partially repaid by the credit guarantee fund trust for micro and small enterprises what is subordinate debt loan raised by the company is categorized as subordinate debt and non subordinate debt subordinate debt is riskier as compared to non subordinate debt and is also comes with a high rate of interest non subordinate debt is given priority in terms of repayment when they face any losses there is also announcement regarding subordinate debt in the budget 2020 2021
that is bank would provide subordinate debt to the msmes these subordinate debt provided by the banks shall be in the form of quasi equity that is banks could acquire stocks in the ownership of msme if they fails to repay next one is about collateral free loan for business including msme for about 3 lakh crore it is to infuse additional funding in the various business that is badly hit by pandemic for this fund the 100 percent credit guarantee cover is given by the government to the banks and the npfcs on principal and interest final one is about global tenders government will issue the tenders for procurement of goods and services mostly foreign companies get benefit of those tenders therefore global tenders will be disallowed in government procurements up to 200 crores it's a important step towards self reliant india and support make in india project it will also help msme to increase their business i have covered in detail about various provision if you have any doubt let me know in the comment section that's all for the day see you tomorrow thank you